before I met Christ, my heart was just wicked. It might still be wicked a little bit, but I was just excited about carnal things, uh, pleasing myself, living for myself, living selfishly. Uh, I grew up south of Atlanta, Georgia, um, influenced by gang violence, uh, hip hop music, just many terrible mistakes I made in my life just led my life further and further down the drain. Uh, when I was about 15 years old, I started doing, you know, rap, hip hop, and I had a few opportunities as a teenager to, uh, you know, bec become a, a big name artist. But when I became a Christian and I learned about the crazy thing Jesus did by giving his life for me, it just changed my all my motives. Everything I wanted in life was just to give him glory. I didn't really care about myself anymore, and I still don't. I mean, I do a lot of things that benefit me, but the core of everything I do, everything I am, is to bring Jesus glory so that other people could know him, to know that he can clean their slate, to know that they can be forgiven for their sins, and they can have a chance at a new life. Um, I was a very big role model in the hood, so I was the guy giving weed to the, to the kid, you know, smoke weed, this is fun, this is cool. I was the guy letting young guys hang out with me and my gang members and, and, and fight people and do crazy stuff. So when I became a Christian, I felt so much guilt, kind of like Paul, who used to kill Christians, now was trying to save people and make them Christians. So I had this weight of, man, I, I gotta go back to the hood and help those people that I negatively influenced find Jesus and find forgiveness and healing. So that really motivates me. The Spirit of God is giving me power to be obedient to God. And it's my pleasure, it's my good pleasure to serve Him. And you know, some days are better than others, I'm not perfect, but the core of my heart is to give God glory with my life. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Young Noah, and I have been ransomed. <laughs>